Welcome to Board Game Empire. Today we're going to do a review of Exit the Secret Temple. Now it's one for players, 10 plus, and provides two, three hours of, uh, of gameplay. Um, this is a puzzle driven, pretty much uh, like finding clues type of game. It's actually my favorite out of all the ones that I've played, the Exit games, the Escape games. Um, the puzzle aspect of the game really. Uh, I really enjoy because I used to do puzzles when I was younger. Me and my brother would do like 3,000 pieces, 5,000. I think the most we ever did was like 10,000. But we used to do puzzles and it was quite enjoyable, relaxing. Um, I was doing the video, the playthrough though. It was quite, um, you know, rushed and it wasn't as relaxing as doing it by yourself. And, you know, it, there's supposed to be a time limit. I don't do with the time limit. Um, I just enjoy the game as is. And so just a great game. Um, the puzzles are actually um, a little bit hard. Um, I was able to do it really quick on the playthrough, but it was, uh, I already had the borders already set up. So and I like the clues. I like the little decoder and every aspect of it, just the best of all the ones I've played so far. And so we're just gonna jump right, right into the review. Um, I really like the rule book. The rule book, I would give it five out of five. Uh, it de it's very detailed, it tells you how to start. It also gives you the information, uh, like if you don't know the clue or anything, it'll give you the answers. So if you get stuck, you can always go to the next one. That's one thing I really enjoy. Because a lot of times it's the, with the escape ones that we did the app. This one we don't have to open our you know phone or tablet or anything to uh, access information. So I like it that they put it in the book. Um, but just a great game. So um, the rules five out of five. Uh, component quality. Um, I like the puzzles. They're actually a nice uh, size and everything. Um, the little cards here, the decoder. So it's four out of five. I mean, some of the components could have been better, but for what it is, it's a, and the price point that it sells for, I mean, this is a great game. So four out of five on the component quality. Um, experience, I would give like a four out of five. Just a great experience. Just, uh, um, I don't know if this is uh, my cup of tea, but I mean, I do love the puzzle aspect, the, the uh, decoder and, and everything that's included. It's just, um, it's a little time consuming at times when you're doing the puzzles. And so that's, uh, but it does remind me that I love doing puzzles. So it did uh, bring that back and, you know, what I used to enjoy when I was younger. So experience four out of five. Uh, mechanics, um, I would give it four out of five. It's um, a little bit strategic because you're having to figure out the codes, but I, mean, I don't know if you would call that strategic, just uh, figuring out stuff, but um, you just bouncing from puzzles, um, using the uh, like uh, rice paper almost, uh, the decoder, the information, just great uh, way to, you know, spend like a couple hours trying to figure out something. And so I would say the mecha uh, mechanics is, you know, just four out of five. Uh, replayability uh, doesn't really have a replayable um, factor to it. So, I mean, you could redo the puzzles, I guess, but um, once you figure it out, it's, you know, you figure it out. So, Give like a one or zero, you know, I can't see you replaying it, but that's what this, these games are 10 for. You just go to the next one. So replayability, uh, one. Um, and then overall total, uh, with this one, I'm going to give it a four, uh, just because I really like the puzzle aspect to it, of it. The decoder, the rule book is phenomenal. Really enjoyed it. It was, uh, it guided you through the whole thing. 
um, like the little, uh, the little cards here. So very impressed with this one. Um, I thought it was, um, I would not enjoy it because, you know, I just haven't done puzzles for such a long time. I thought it might be monotonous and, you know, but it, it's actually relaxing. And so very impressed with it. So four out of five. Um, if you have any comments, just leave a comment in the comment section. If, you know, you just want to discuss anything, um, I'm going to have a link of where to buy the game. Uh, if you like the video, please like subscribe. And I'll see you in the next video.